Be founded right here in New Orleans as it's growing rapidly and is freeing up New Orleans police manpower in the process. And for more than a year, they've responded to thousands of car accidents in New Orleans. David Jones rode along with them today. So right now we're going to a vehicle accident with injury at a Legion Field and Fillmore. When we get on scene, the drivers have each been taken to separate hospitals, but the roads still blocked with an overturned SUV and on the neutral ground the motorcycle it collided with. You're coordinating with Levy right. Board on scene, you're coordinating with NOPD. Right, it's very easy to coordinate with NOPD. They know we're here to help yeah. them. So if we can tow the vehicle on their behalf, so they don't have to come out here right away, they can send that officer to the hospitals while we're towing the vehicle. Yeah, I'm gonna need a, a tow for a vehicle accident. On scene services, or OSS, is not a new resource in the city, but its ramped up presence is. Right now the city has 142 calls and a majority of those are non-accident calls and you still have uh, NOPD police officers handling the accidents where on scene services can go out and handle those accidents for them. Well, it's up to us as a community to decide how do we best want to use these limited officer hours, this scarce resource? Ethan Sheremy founded OSS in 2018 as a pilot, and the city brought them on last year to supplement NOPD. Now you see OSS responding as the primary response unit to traffic accidents for the New Orleans Police Department. Since May last year, OSS has responded to 10,500 non-injury traffic accidents, nearly half of the 23,000 total non-injury traffic calls to 911. The company currently handles about 32 calls a day, but plans to scale up to 50 calls a day over the coming year. New Orleans, on average, receives a total of 74 calls a day, including injury, non-injury, and hit and runs. There's a direct correlation for every call serviced by an OSS agent the New Orleans Police Department has about two officer hours that can be redeployed to a higher priority type call for service. All the agents are retired law enforcement or current law enforcement from outside of Orleans Parish working part time. But everyone who has worked here has had at least five years of on the job experience with the police department and most of that time has been spent in patrol or in traffic operations. It's easier to already have a former police officer who knows how to work a traffic accident than it would be to hire someone who's never been a cop before and teach them, hey, this is how you work a traffic accident, this is how you talk to people, this is how you read the computer. Sheremy says with NOPD's manpower crisis, it's a niche that needed to be filled. We're showing that there can be a new level of service to the citizens of the city, uh, and it doesn't need to be pr provided by NOPD. Sheremy says NOPD officers review every report on scene services files and they hope to start taking on new low level calls, for example, abandoned cars. While a locally founded company, they're already operating in Baltimore with plans to expand to other cities. Sheremy says Austin, Texas is next.